name is Shanti. My name is Shanti. I have, I, I have a few words to say. I have a few words to say. Let's do it. People's right. Okay. Mic check. Mic check. My name's Sean D. My name's Sean D. Thanks for coming out in this weather. Thanks for coming out in this weather. A beautiful Washington Day. A beautiful Washington Day. Okay, so I have a short speech for you. I have a short speech for you. I hope it's not too boring. I hope it's not too boring. Here it goes. Here it goes. Here it goes. Are we going to people's mic this whole thing? No. no. I, don't I, don't think that's, I don't think that's entirely necessary. Okay. It's very loud. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Some people would say that our movement lacks a purpose. Some people would say we lack direction. That we are but a gathering of the young, optimistic, and naive peoples of the world. This is not true. These people are wrong. They have been misled. And to alleviate these worries and assumptions, I would like to tell you what I think this movement is about. <clears throat> We are the forgotten majority, coming to terms with the fact that television has fed us a lie. We dreamt the delusional dreams of dreamers for too long. Dreams of the billionaire and dreams of the rock star. We, have brought, we bought into a system that promised us freedom and delivered only slavery. We receded into the depths of hopelessness and apathy. We found out that the change we thought we could believe in was just another marketing gimmick. <clears throat> and then one day, for some reason, we awoke from our dream. We freed ourselves from our personal delusion and saw the state of the world that complacency had bought, uh, had created for us. Hey, I know the <clears throat> One sec. Uh, we saw where the path led and realized it wasn't a pretty road ahead of us. Some would say that this is about our battle against the 1%. Some would say that it's a battle against greed. Others would say it's a battle against poverty and war. But I would say it's more than that. This is about humanity. This is about the great awakening of our collective mind. This is about freeing ourselves from the distractions and the divisions of the old ways. This is about a global evolution of thought and consciousness. A realization of our interconnectedness to one another, regardless of our national borders, religion, age, gender, or ethnicity. We have come to see each other for the things we have in common, and not the things that we don't. We have matured as a species and now recognize our unique role as stewards of this earth and of our futures in it. Through this connection, through this bond, we can create a new world. One free from the pain of poverty. One unshackled from the slavery of greed. Uh, one, <clears throat> one freed from the tyranny of corruption and the brutality of war. We can create this world with our cooperation and our will. And ensure that our future <clears throat> is bright and that the paradigms of the old world are long forgotten. We can usher in a new age together. A new way of thinking. A new renaissance. That is what this is about to me. Yeah. yeah. yeah.